Hello everybody, this is Jose Betancourt, and as always, thank you for viewing my video. So, I just want to show off the camera capabilities of the Note 8. Here are some pictures that I took with the Note 8. Some in RAW format, where I edit it on the Lightroom mobile application. And some are edited right out of the default camera editor. So, let's take a look. At some recent photos and if you follow my channel you know that I have a Fuji X-T2 a Nikon D7100 and I enjoy myself some street photography so here's one of a garage that is at the corner of my block and at night this orange sign orange slash red it looks kind of spooky so I figured I'd take a picture this was in raw format and I edited it on Lightroom. Here is the image of a gentleman on a scooter. I took this in Manhattan and this was actually in JPEG. I was sitting in the car when I took the photo and it actually came out cool. Whoop. Let me uh, make sure my focus is good here. And here's the color version of this particular photo. Of course, I messed around with the saturation of the colors. So out of the camera, it didn't necessarily come out like that. And here's one where I shot in pro mode and I put low shutter speed, low ISO, and I waited for some cars to drive by and I aimed at the street or my focal point was at the street and this was the results of course since it was in uh, raw format I was able to edit in Lightroom once again here's my Nintendo Classic Edition the Mini you can see the live focus in the background it works pretty good and here's a photo of my son this was actually taken at night I gotta say that the Samsung Note 8 does a really good job with nighttime photos now when you do live focus the image gets darker so you gotta be careful about that so as you can see look at the blur in the background my son stands out in the photo and it came out pretty good Here's another one I messed around with. Of course, I had to utilize it or utilize Lightroom and somewhat get an old grainy look. This is just me messing around with some filters. And again, once again, I, I used the live focus. So you have a blurry background, a very dark image. Once again, live focus. Unfortunately for my son, I, I used them a lot as a model. <laughs> but here the live focus really came out good. You see the people in the background, or you can't really distinguish them. But you do see some parts right here that are not out of focus, so it's not perfect. So it does really well with certain types of photos. And... Unfortunately, it doesn't do that well with other types of photos. So you will notice, as I stated right here, it is not in focus. Or it is in focus, not blurred out. Once again, I was in my car in traffic. Whoops. And I saw this lady asking for money in the road. And she's on the street along with the cars asking for money just uh, pushing herself uh, on her own uh, so I saw an opportunity from the driver's side window to take a photo and basically this is how I framed it and of course I had to edit it on the default application the photo editor that comes with the Note 8 and these are the results here is me once again testing out live focus.
in my Subaru Impreza 2018. Came out really sharp. And you can see how nice and blurry the background is. Unfortunately, I don't know if this particular area came out blurry. Kind of hard to tell. And here is another shot. The one train in, in Harlem. I'm trying to think of this, this stop. But anyway. I was uh, walking to lunch. I stood underneath the one train. And took this photo. I believe this is a nostalgia. Hmm, I think it is nostalgia. Uh, the uh, filter. And it looks really good. I just wanted to share these photos with you and quite frankly it is very impressive what I can do with this camera really quick this Note 8 screen is fantastic I mean look at this photo and it looks like I'm holding a photo instead of a camera or a phone I mean it's unbelievable on a side note the Note 8 has been amazing so far so good as you can see there, even though I had an application open, I hit the virtual home button. I have it customized so that I have my applications here. Let me do that again. Hit my Yelp. I have all my applications in folders. So I got my social networks. I have my photography folder. And I have my movies, Whoop. music, movies, and entertainment. So that's why you see me with no icons on my home screen, just my wife and my son. And I can easily swipe up if I want to find the rest of my applications. So there's so many options. Uh, that's one thing I enjoy about Android. You have the you have the capability of doing things the way you want to do it and of course this note pen it's just amazing editing photos editing movies or just navigating around the phone and one more thing i gotta show off that touch feature i have the fingerprint sensor and i swipe and boom so there you have it those are some photos i took with my note 8 i hope you enjoyed them if you have a note 8 of your own, let me know in the comment section where I can find some of your photos. So until next time, I'm Jose Betancourt. Talk to you soon.